Remember, the looser your calves are, the less pressure you put on the major joints of your body. And to answer the question that nobody's asking but is thinking, no, this stretch does not get any easier. I think I'm stuck up in a, stuck up in a, yeah. I think I'm stuck up in a, stuck up in a, stuck up in a fairy tale. Stuck up in a fairy tale. The one thing I want to explain is, I'm going to kind of explain it in a story of someone I talked to earlier this week. And um, if this sounds like a conversation that we had, I'm not singling you out because I've literally had this conversation 150 times in the last, I don't know, a week. All right, guys, let's make some lines. New friends on the far side, let's do it. Y'all so nothing I want to play songs. And I'm never someone to play with a nigga. I reach out to one of our, our members. Say, hey, it's been a while since you've been in class. What's going on? Oh, I'm having some, uh, some sciatic issues, so it's been hard for me to get to class. Cool. No problem. Understand. Hey, uh, what are you doing to take care of that? Are you stretching? Are you doing acupuncture? Are you doing PT? Uh, what are you doing? Uh, nothing. Okay, cool. Listen, acupuncture is the best thing. Like, I swear by acupuncture. I love it. Oh, I can't. I, I, I can't do that. I'm afraid of needles. Okay, maybe. I'm like, they're not really needles. They're really tiny, tiny little things that, that will make you feel better. Yeah, no, I, I know, but I can't. Okay, so then what are you going to do to get better? I, I don't know. Guys, it, it, it's just, it's a losing mentality. It's a losing mindset. I'm George Lucas, I'm star stuttered, I hate stunting. Yeah, I don't write raps, I make songs. Hit the Himalayas, I'm white rapped and with Left, right, left, straight punches, and then short. One, two, three, four, bring it back. Jab, cross, jab. One, two, three, four. Bring it back. I've been on race songs. Y'all, so nothing I want to play songs. And I'm never someone to play with. You have to be proactive, right? You have to do whatever it takes to resolve your problems, right? Physical problems, emotional problems, relationship problems. You have to get aggressive. Like, I've always been super aggressive about self improvement. I just always have, right? Um, when I was like, super young and out of my own for the first time and like broke as broke could be. I never sacrificed the quality of the food that I ate. I remember I used to spend every dollar I had on really healthy organic food. And people would be like, why do you spend so much at like Whole Foods when you can go to whatever and get cheap food? I'm like, because my health is the most important thing. Knee to elbow, knee to elbow. When I say switch, I go right to push-ups. Kathy goes right to the spider bands. So our motivational quote of the day, I like this one. Uh, just when the caterpillar thought the world was over, it became a butterfly. That's cheesy and corny and cool, right? Yeah, so, it's so if you're going through a really hard time, that's okay. The caterpillar thought it was over too. And then it grew wings. It's so cheesy, I love it, it's great. Our fit tip of the day is about the benefits of broccoli. I love broccoli, let me tell you all about it. Hmm? Me too. It uh, strengthens your immune system, helps maintain a healthy heart, protects your eyes, removes toxins and free radicals from your body, and it's good for your skin. All right, guys, you know what to do on the count of three. Let's close it out the only way we know how. Ready, one, two, three. I just, I just don't hesitate. Like, my health is the most important thing to me, and I want to stress that to you guys. If you can just develop the skill that, you, that being aggressive and being just hyper proactive the moment anything gets a little, right, just a little off, go for it. Because guess what? It's not gonna resolve itself. Uh, you have to think, you know, if something's a little off now, just like stress, emotional, not eating right, you know, back pain, whatever, like it's not gonna magically fix stuff. You have to really get aggressive as to uh, making progress with that. There's a pose that says when you and your significant other are about to fight, suck helium out of the balloons and try and fight that way. I was like, that's just what it feels like if someone tries to fight with you. Because yeah. you're just so nice. Like <laughs> trying to yell at you, you would just look at them and smile and they'd be like, I'm, I'm not mad anymore. <laughs> so I like coming to class when I don't have work and my phone decided to update itself in the middle of the night and we're still updating this morning. And I woke up at nine o'clock and I never sleep past seven. Oh and I went, oh, what day is it? You're like, am I supposed to be there already? Like, I was freaking out. I'm like, oh my god, work. And I'm like, but I didn't work today. But I'm supposed to work out. And I was like, and I gotta make a phone call. When my sister was pregnant with Dylan, she wanted, like, she loves spicy food, but once she got pregnant, like, she wanted everything with hot sauce on it. And everyone's like, oh, the baby's gonna have a lot of hair. Kid has a lot of hair, oh so god, I believe so that. Nice. He's gonna be Maui for Halloween because he has oh such long hair. God. They had to cut it because his hair started going in his eyes really bad to the point where he started crawling into the couch. Oh. <laughs>
Anything that's going on, please don't dwell, don't wait, don't whine, don't complain, don't make excuses, and don't ever say this to me or to, or to yourself. Don't ever say, there's nothing I can do. That's crazy, that's so crazy. There's nothing you can do, that's nuts. There's always something that you can do. Deep breaths in through the nose, out through the mouth. How's everybody feeling? Yeah, that was, okay, the right side of the room is feeling good, the left side of the room is like, ah, uh, we're kind of friends, I'll see how the rest of the class goes. Grab your toes, pull your heels up, get that deep calf stretch. Remember, the looser your calves are, the less pressure you put on the major joints of your body. And to answer the question that nobody's asking but is thinking, no, the stretch does not get any easier. So it's left hook, right uppercut, switch, switch, left uppercut, right hook. So bring your hips up as you come up out of your squat. Once I hit 10, Kathy and I are gonna switch, or not run into each other. I'm gonna hold the wall stick, Kathy does 10's two most squats. Once she hits 10, we'll switch again, and keep going for the last minute of class. Anything that's going on, please don't dwell, don't wait, don't whine, don't complain, don't make excuses, and don't ever say this to me, or to, or to yourself. Don't ever say, there's nothing I can do. That's crazy, that's so crazy. There's nothing you can do, that's nuts. There's always something that you can do. Be extremely proactive. Our fifth tip is about the benefits of squash, and it is squash season, so this is cool. It helps to boost your immune system, gives relief from asthmatic conditions, helps to improve your bone and eye health, and helps to improve your blood circulation. So up your squash game, butternut squash, spaghetti squash, acorn squash. It's also the season of squash, because pumpkin is also a gourd slash squash type thing. So up your squash game. We end every class with two power claps and allowed rock stars on the count of three, just to affirm how awesome we are. So ready? One, two, three! Appreciate you guys, love you all. Thank you very much for your attention. Please hit the share button so we can uh, get this message out there. Remember, be proactive, don't wait, don't procrastinate. Get it done, share the video, love you guys. See you next week, episode 51. Listen. If this goes in the episode, I'm gonna get fired. Ed's been saying some really bad dad jokes lately and I think it's rubbing off and I'm, I'm slightly offended. <laughs>